So today, uh, some of the cadre instructors that we designated, mostly squad leaders, uh, came out to the training area in the urban environment to train the uh, Australian military and Japanese military. Uh, after that was conducted, we had V-22 Ospreys land uh, the remaining force, about a company size element, to further uh, enhance those relations with the Australian military and Japanese military in urban operations. So right now I'm with the MRF D of uh, Marine Rotational Force Darwin uh, with 1 1 Charlie Company, uh, designated as Task Force Chosen. We came to Robertson Barracks in Darwin, and now we have been flown to Rockhampton, training in the Shoalwater Bay training area, along with the Australian military and the Japanese Self Defense Force. Oh, it is. It's a very rare opportunity, and uh, most of the guys around me are very excited to conduct this training with uh, other forces to learn how they operate and. Hopefully uh, with our operations and the way they operate, we can find uh, a median of what works best with each other and uh, further enhance our lethality in uh, possible future operations. Um, it's not really, honestly, we feel very comfortable with these guys. Uh, we, we show them the way we do things. They show us the way they do things. We're very uh, receptive to uh, criticism and the things that we think work best and what don't work best. Um, overall, a very uh, healthy training environment. Uh, we're definitely feeding off each other and uh, I believe it's creating a, a healthy environment, a healthy relationship between each uh, partner nation. Um, around here, it's, it's a little bit wet. Uh, guys get uncomfortable, but for the most part, they are, they're still doing their jobs and maintain that morale and just being Marines. Um, the terrain is a little bit challenging also, you know, high grass and uh, just open fields. And uh, it, it kind of it uh, puts the emphasis on our training uh, back home that we need to be able to operate in different areas, not just where we're used to, so that we can uh, execute any operation, any climbing place, just like we always say we do. Yeah, so this morning um, we entered the uh, urban zone tactically. So basically um, from the battalion Liga, we formed up in chalks of around 20. So in our case, an infantry platoon plus, um, plus engineer attachments. We then uh, landed out in the sticks and conducted um, a, a clearance of a certain portion of Raspberry Creek um, in conjunction with other 6RR subunits. All right, so Alpha and Delta Company um, have been training with the partner forces, just getting back to basics, um, getting an exposure for urban operations. As uh, basically the last couple of years we're doing our lead up and um, deployment and subsequently coming back from operations, it's a good hit out for some of the younger guys and uh, probably some of their first um, exposures to urban operations with partner forces outside of, uh, outside of their initial training. So Southern Jackaroo is trying to achieve an exercise where we work together with the United States Marine Corps and the Japanese Ground Self-Defense Force to work on our communication and fighting skills together. Some of the scenarios that we've been to doing together as uh, the three nations of exercise Southern Jackaroo have involved using the American Ospreys for our air mobile assaults, uh, urban tactics in the urban operating training facility and fighting in the field uh, as the three nations together. I think training with the United States Marines and the Japanese is really important because if we do have to fight beside them in the future, we know what to expect and we're better prepared to work with them uh, in that case. Working with the Japanese has been uh, a real insight into a different fighting organisation. Uh, they go through a planning process very disciplined um, and it's been interesting to see a different per, uh, perspective on how to plan. Working with the United States Marines has been quite fun. Uh, they have an, an amazing amount of capability and a lot of firepower. 